first series, here are OD Pixel and Fought. Thank you very much, Nahas. And here we have it, day two of the Major. And what a series to begin with. EG versus VP. Man, look at Sumail. Seven and one last hits to the 15 and six of the Death Prophet. He's really getting punished by this Undying. Up top as well, look at him versus position. He's coming right round, grabbing the creep wave. But Solo and Ramses, they'll just to turn towards him. They've got the shackles, they've got the bugs, and Universe is done. That's first blood to Ramses. A little deep there. Easy up top. See Solo. Solo does have a little with him. The wards are drops. And now Artiz, he's got to run. He's very speedy though. Oh my god, that damage. The soul rip, bringing him down incredibly low. Lil, trying to chase and finish him, but no, will actually get it with the decay. That's Arteezy down for 70, no buyback. EG, they've got to buy back somehow. They're, they'll come in, Shackles there, the instant silence from Crit. Buying some space for Universe. EG moving in, looking towards Lil. Crit rolls forward and finds the connection. Lil's down. See if VP could get anything more. Pash is there with a the wraparound. Oh, the Dream Core cancelling Samael's TP. He'll be held in place. They're bringing in no one on the Death Prophet for the damage, the silence. As they look to surround Samael in these trees, he's trying to juke his way out of it. Fear with the Winter's Curse, looking to hold back VP, but Ramses is there with a the wraparound, takes down Fear, now turns up to the fight to look towards Samael, and Samael, he's surrounded by four. Samael's down as well, double kill for Ramses. The two supports killed Arteezy by themselves. The Roche attempt. Cooldown's back up as well, Winter's Curse. EG do have this great AoE as well as what VP have. Pasha actually jumping forward, gets the silence, two-man dream call, BKB pop by RTZ, Samael moves forward, looks towards no one, no one gets the siphon off. He's gonna be able to keep himself alive. No, Uni, he comes in, he goes, he's got the lasso, he drags no one back into the boulder smash, no one falling low and falling down, no one's gone. The stone gate's blocking onto the Weaver, Rams he's gone as well. Oh my god. And they get the Roshan. And Sumail gets... Does he get all three? He got refresher shard. He's not able to pick up anything else, though the wards are actually trapping it. And Solo actually kills the agents. He manages to deny the agents with his wards. Okay. Pasha jumping back in. Oh, he's he actually dead. Him? Pasha does get the kill. And Pasha, he may... I mean, they messed up the initial boulder smash in silence, so he might be able to get out of this one. Yeah, he's got the blink and he's out. A bit of a whiffed combo there. Yeah. Starting the rush, get scouted by the orb. See if they can get away with this one. Universe Cyrus comes out. Oh, it holds back one already. Trying to go in on the sidelines. Arteezy moves forward, but the cooldown connects onto both Solo and Ramses. Ramses pops the BKB, turns towards Arteezy, but Ramses is falling low. Has the time lapse, gets himself back up to full. Stone Gaze holding them back. In fact, they've got the lasso. Universe grabs Pasha. Pasha's down. No one's popped the exorcism, but he's being kept at bay here. He's trying to get stuck in, but with two guys down on VP, it's very hard for the rest of the team to get a fight going at all. Boulder Smash comes through for Crit. He has the control. Oh the silence onto two. That's the Undying down, they surround no one. This exorcism surely not enough to save him. He's got a lot of regen flying through with the siphon. He is still alive. Ramses has come back in. Samael very, very low. Have they got enough to finish off that Medusa? The regen comes in. That's going to be back up to full health. No one, dead. but RTZ gets the kill on Ramses. No one surrounded. He's the last man alive for VP, and he's gone as well. Wow. VP getting team wiped by evil geniuses. The coordination with Crit and Fear, they really Oh, the buybacks are coming in as well. The, the triple buybacks, they know they can't let this Roche go. Yeah, it's way too important. Radiance top tower is under attack. Oh, and look yeah. who it is. Universe. Oh, they do have the silence yep. to stop the follow-up combo from Crit, so Ramses will be fine for now. Gets the chance to BKB time lapse. Actually, Samael deciding to TP back because Toplane is getting shoved in by the creeps. BP, they've got the double server wards ready, they've got exorcism. Everything. Trying to break the Lincolns with the snake. They do break one. Ah, Pasha. The coil onto two. Samuel just standing his ground. Man fighting up against Ramses. Cooldowns there as well. They've got the Winter's Curse. Holding Ramses in place. There's the lasso. Universe jumps in. He's found the grab. Bringing Ramses back into the clutches of the boulder smash. Ramses, he's down. He's down for two minutes. Again, the control is perfect. Can VP hit back hard? They're certainly going to try. They're moving in with the ghost up to the high ground. Shackles onto a Ricky. And now they're looking towards Death Prophet. Death Prophet's down. That's two cores of VP down for two minutes without buyback. Samael cleaning up as he claims the double. Four heroes are gone. Nobody with buyback available on VP. If EG shove it down a lane now, they could just end this game. The Weaver and Death Prophet. As well as on the other side, oh, I'm dying throwing it on the I arrow. love these plays, they're the best. The crew is not quite close enough to take down the back top protection, but when it is, Silo's ready to drop those wards. He might just do it anyway. Oh, he will. 
It's pretty underwhelming. I mean, well, it is with the backdoor protection. <laughs> they need the creep wave closer. Yeah, he does. The creep wave's nearly close enough. Come on, creep wave. Get yourself over it. Uh, it's it's going to be there soon. I'm back sure it's lines. being kept out on just on the back of it. Indeed, Solo's down. Now, is this strong? More from these two teams. Yeah, PG. Go for the Megas here. And BP stop it. Put the lineup alive. Take that universe for you. Oh, he did try and jump in. Indeed, the Yules comes out. He'll force himself away. No one going in. Oh, the four man dream cover. The BKB is popped out by Artiz. He turns towards no one, but no one keeps himself alive. So the Crest Evasion doing a lot for him. They'll drop the Nullifier down, but he's still fine. Artiz is falling low. They have got the lasso onto the puck. Can they kill Pasha in time? They can. Pasha's is down, but they've lost me. No, there's no Pasha's still alive. He managed to live, they didn't quite finish him off. Samael's still going, finishes off Lil. Can they get Samael out of this fight? They can, they'll take Samael down, buy back from Lil. As VP looks to continue this, this fight, Iron Ramsey's getting low, Boulder Smash catches out onto Samael. Arteezy able to claim the Shadow Shaman, he's down for 100 seconds. Samael buying back for this, he's now backing off. They're respecting the fact that no one's ready to chase. They'll turn, they've got the flame break knocked back onto no one, back into the clutches of Arteezy. Samael forces forward, closes the gap. No one's down for two minutes. No buyback. Ramses, he's trying his best to clean things up. He'll get the kill onto the Earth Spirit, but Crit immediately buys back. TP's back into the fight. He knows with two cores down on VP, this should be enough for EG to close up game one. An incredible fashion. What wow. a game one to start day two here of the ROG Dream League Major with. As EG, they take the tier fours. Solo, I believe he's got the double serpent wards. We'll see if it does anything. But look who's been caught on the back again. Universe, he finds the Weaver. There'll be a buyback, but GG well played is called. This game is over. Evil geniuses. Questions were sort of asked about this roster coming into this match. And at the switch ups in the drafts and the way that the yeah. teams want to play the game. So this time around, EG with the DP, with the Lycan, they had a very rough early game. Yes, game they did. One. This time round, they're looking to be. Top passion. Again, just because it's going to the playing round. Nice cancel by Crip. Crip. It was an outplay there with the crush. Asha. Oh, have face shift to no back. So first blow. Lane, Lil. Drag back onto some mouths. Spirit Siphon. Should be enough to keep. Say. He has the mech finished on the tide. Easy, looking to get aggressive here. Looking for somebody. He is straight in. I want him out with the dream. Carl Lil steals the howl. Just for the army chasing him down. He's to be in trouble. Can they keep this Lycan back off him? They cannot. Artsy he finds the kill. Now turns towards Ramsey. Throws and it down on him. Artsy taking a lot of damage. Will get the kill. The book. Well, very low. He's going to survive. Yeah, the call down killed the book. Crit gets cleaned up. No one comes in. Gets both of them with the lasers and rockets. Samael's still hunting as well behind this tower. He is rather low. He's got to be careful of no one coming back in. Pasha jumps forward. He's able to take the Aegis out of the hands of Samael. No one's starting to lay down the marching machines from the high ground. Spam as well from the rockets. Won't be enough to kill them as they have got the mech from the universe. GG back up to full. He knows there's a ward on that high ground. Just going to jump on have a crit comes in. One man crush immediately gets dragged back with the telekinesis. Cold embraces there for a bit. Five time for crit. Dream call just onto one. The Winter's Curse holds back Ramsey. Missile still flying forward onto crit. The orbs there from Pasha closes the gap on fear. Fear's down. He'll be trying to chase for more. The walls at the moment sort of slowing down Ramsey's there with the body blocking. They have a homing missile inbound for crit. BP really want to chase. They know that they can punish EG even heavier. They get the lockdown. Missile inbound and will connect onto Crit Samel. Jumps back in. Look at the siphon. There's the Ravage Tree Universe. Catches the puck and the Night Stalker. That's Pasha down. Arteezy pops the ult. Looks towards Lil, but Lil, he steals the ult and he's running away. Some dog on dog action as Lil the puppy outruns his father. And EG, they've found Ramses as well. They've got the Yule's catch. They'll surround the Gyro. BKB popped by Arteezy as he mans up, brings down the Gyro. Lil continuing to run himself away. The Samael's hunting, he has the slow from the Siphon, VP, they've lost three, maybe even four with Lil dealing with this army, beating him down, Crit jumps in for the finishing blow, as VP lose four. And no one, this is, uh, this is the time we really need to, to use. Good shadow bladed up there, you see no one. Oh, you know he him. finds the crush, straight in universe immediately with a Ravage follow up, have they got the damage, the second Ravage comes through catching three, and with no one down, 
We'll see how much EG can do with this, but this is an absolutely huge opening for them to find here. No Tinker for 90 seconds, and yeah, they'll just tap out. It's game over. Without the Tinker, they cannot hold. EG, they take the series 2-0 against BP. Yeah, I feel like the game ramped up so quickly. As soon as Crit got that Blink Dagger, it was just like kill after kill. EG yeah. was swinging with their momentum.